Oh, no. Use your red stick to rotate the camera when you're in the wild area. And if you press the red stick, you'll find you can see a wider view of things. Press the yellow button to look straight ahead again. Really? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. That's nice. Oh, fucking Tyrogue. Man, they want your ass. The Pokemon you'll see in the wild area mark Dy Pokemon dens. Dynamax Pokemon dwell in these dens. And you'll be able to battle them by investigating the den. You can start the battle on your own and get up to three players to help you out. I gained 300 W, apparently. Defeat a Dynamax Pokemon and you'll get a chance at catching it. Additionally, there are some rare items that you can only obtain by battling Dynamax Pokemon. When wild Pokemon Dynamax, they become incredibly powerful. They may unleash multiple moves in a row and take other actions you won't see in a regular battle. Working together with other trainers will be key as you take on these Dynamax Pokemon together as a team of four. Um... It's a one star. I don't know... See, here's the thing. I don't know what level these are meant to be. So I don't know when I'm supposed to take them out. Like, when's a good time to take them on? I'll maybe have a look after my first gym. I'm not really too interested right now, I guess. We will get to that. I should be going that way, shouldn't I? I just want to get more W. There's energy pouring out of then. I gained 300 W. This, uh, is that like a cliffa? Cliffa? I don't know what that could be. It kind of looks like it has Cliffa's ears. And it's a fairy? That's the only Pokemon I can think of that's a fairy. Although I'm sure there's lots more. I guess I'll just go to... Uh, what's the place? Oh, what the fuck are you? You seem like a big boy. I don't know if I want to fight... Uh, okay. Here, let's... Let's get a quick heal just in case. Do I need to actually? Yeah, fuck it. Let's do it. I bought them for a reason. I may as well use them. Okay, so what are you? Very strong looking mud stale. Ah, it's like a Clyde stale. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, no, I'm not I'm not too interested anymore. Hey Mudsdale, do you like dolls? Apparently yes. Yeah, I don't really want to fight that. Ah, oh, you're like the little pigeon thing. A pit of, that's it, yeah. Now this should be more my level. Yeah, it is more my level. Um I'll tell you what. Wow, this pepper actually the pepper actually has really fitting moves for what I called him. Um Yeah, put pepper in. Let's put pepper in. Man, Pepper got hurt. So, what's laser focus? Will always result in a critical hit. Okay, that sounds good to me. Okay, let's laser focus. Pepper concentrated intensely. Oh, no, my attack fell. That's okay. I guess it doesn't really matter. Let's quick attack it. I think I get priority attack anyway. I think I'm faster. Uh, okay, let's tackle. And then swap out because I don't want Pepper to die, right? I feel like that'd be too mean. Um, Dogachu would be good. Let's put in a little D. Because once again, I don't want to kill it, and I feel like I might kill it if I use Dogachu. Okay, 
Okay, so if I peck it... Mm, that's probably fine. Probably. There you go, nailed it. Perfect. Now, what am I going to name... What am I going to name a Pidove? Why people go these Pokemon follow? If you're scattering food for them, be careful. Several hundred of them can gather at once. Yeah, we'll give Pit of a nickname. So, what would I call a Pit of? Okay, uh, this might be a dumb, dumb name, actually. Uh, well, no, that wouldn't fit anyway. Um, I was going to name him 314, because Pi, right? Um, but I can't do that. Because I'm pretty sure that wouldn't fit. Unless I did it with numbers. But do I really want to name my Pokemon numbers? Yeah, I'll do that. He's going to be 3... I'm not a dumbass, right? And 314, like, is Pi. I just want to double check. Well, 3.14. Uh, Pi. Yeah. I mean, technically. That is it. Okay, so 3.14. We'll just call him Pi. Yeah, I'll just, we'll just call him Pi. We won't call him 3.14. We'll just call him Pi. Uh, send him to the box. Don't really want Pi on my team. I just kind of want him to exist within my box. Was that the sound of Toad? Are these donkeys? A mud bray. Oh, you must turn into the... No, oh, the sunlight is harsh. Okay, perfect. So this must be the one that turns into the, what is it, Mudsdale or whatever? I don't want to kill it. I don't think this will kill it. And even if it does, there's another one, right? I can just get the new one. My very stamina. Oh, interesting. Okay. Okay, so every time I hit it... Oh, shit. It has Rock Smash. I thought that'd be super effective against me. Ember probably won't work. Oh, no, that worked really well, actually. Okay, so every time it gets hit, its defense goes up. That's That sounds pretty good. Holy shit. I knew I should have gotten Zidane out of there. Zidane. Excuse me. I knew I should have gotten Zidane out of there. Fuck. Okay. Um... Dogachu is probably a bad one to put in. So I'm gonna assume it's a ground type, right? Put a little D in. Let's throw in little D. Let's see what Power Trip does. Man, that was a critical hit. Man, Power Trip is shit. I should probably use a potion, to be honest. Okay, let's peck. 
Wow. Do I use a Great Ball on Mudbray? Okay, let's use a potion. On Lil D. Unfortunately, it's too late for Zidane. Way too late for Zidane. But we can keep Lil D up. Uh, barely. We can barely keep Lil D up. Should I just try for the Great Ball? Now nah, we'll try to- we'll use one more potion on Lil D. If he almost kills Lil D again, then I might use... Eh. Okay, Lil D's gonna die. Lil D's probably gonna die. Let's Fury Attack. That did nothing. I might use... I'll use a normal Pokeball a couple of times, and we'll see if that gets him. But I'm pretty sure... that I'm probably gonna need to use a Great Ball. Which kind of pains me, considering... I probably don't need to. But I want him! Never mind, we got him with a normal Pokeball. Alright, perfect. Okay, well, I know what I want to call this one. Dude, poor Zidane. Gets no XP. Loads weighing up to 50 times as much as its own body weight pose no issue for this Pokemon. It's skilled at making use of mud. I can carry a lot. Uh, yeah, so I already kind of know what I want to name this one. Uh, I want to name this one Donkey. So, Donk. Okay. Donkey. Uh, like, realistically, this is one I probably should keep. Because it seems really good. Brave by nature. Likes to run. Okay, that's good to know. Yeah, like this one seems like I should keep it. But for now, Donkey can go to the box. Actually, let me see something really quick. Uh, I mean, having a dog at you would be nice. I'm, you know, maybe I could trade out Wabu for Donkey. Because I have a dark type in Tatsuya. I'm probably overthinking this a little bit too much, right? But, like, I have a dark type already. I have a normal type in Pepper. I don't really need Wabu. Yeah, I don't really need Wabu. I mean, I'll take his held item. Because, fuck you, Wabu, you don't need it. But I think I will bring out Dunkey. Wait, boxes are? What's this one, yeah. You can keep extra Pokemon in your Pokemon boxes. You've got your own boxes in the Pokemon storage system, which you can access at the Rotom information terminals. Rotomai. Found in Pokemon centers everywhere. You can retrieve Pokemon from your boxes at any Rotomai you visit, too. Um, yeah, I want Donkey, and I'm gonna move... I can change his markings. What does that mean? Take out Wapu. Now, what does it mean, change markings? I don't really... Can I do that? I'm like, yeah, I don't really get the point of that, if I'm being honest. Okay, so we have Donkey, which should actually be a pretty good Pokemon, I think. Okay, we'll get a... Like, realistically... Wait, hold on. 
Yeah, Zidane, Zidane is done for now. I don't really think I can help Zidane. I think Sapphire so Store was up to. Okay, just as that. Okay, I'll use both my potions on Donkey. I'll move Donkey up here, and I'm gonna use Donkey to try and capture whatever that panda is. Okay, what are okay? What are you? I want I, like these always seem kind of unique. Oh my god, it's one of these things. Now I've seen this in well, I've seen it some um, evolve form. What is it called? Beware in the anime. Uh, it, weird, and it creeps me out. So I'm sure this one will too. Okay, well, I'll get kind of what I want to call it, I guess. Baby doll eyes. Uh, you know what? That's even. That might even be better. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not. I don't know. I don't know. I'll, I'll see what I can call it. I'll see what I I decide to name it. So what does Bulldoze do? Everything around it by stomping around on the ground. Lowers the speed stats of those hit. Yeah, let's Bulldoze it. Okay, I can do that again. And that would probably be perfect, actually. Unless I get a crit. In which case, then, well, fuck. Uh, cause I do, I do kind of want this. I should be able to catch it. There we go. Easy, easy catch. Okay, so I, I kind of know what I want to. What I want to call this? Actually, let me just. Let me just see something really quick. I'm not trying to look up the spelling. I just want to make sure that. Um, what I want to call it makes sense. Okay, All right, never mind. I'm gonna go with my. One of my options. I am going to call it. No, let's just see this first. It's filthy fur is a delight to pet, but carelessly reaching out to touch his Pokemon could result in painful retaliation. I am going to nickname this one Plushy, because I think it fits. I think that's how you spell Plushy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how you spell Plushy. If it's not, I can just change it. Uh, go to the box, part, uh, Plushy. Okay, which one's this? I I need to check. It's an onyx. Now this is one I can capture though. You know, Onyx, funnily enough, actually used to be one of my favorite Pokemon. Um not it's it, it's not really that good or even that interesting of a Pokemon. When I was younger, I just thought it looked cool. I was like, oh, it's a giant snake made out of boulders. That's pretty neat. And that's about as far as it went. I thought it looked neat. I never caught one, though, funnily enough. Never actually ended up catching one. Not putting squeeze on me. Yeah, you know, I think Dunk is actually gonna be a bit of a mainstay. He. It... Ah, fuck. I didn't think that would kill it. I shouldn't have tried. I thought I could get away with one more. 
You know what? I need to go and bring Zidane back so Zidane gets a piece of the sweet XP. Yeah, I'll leave the Vulpix and the Panda for now. Let's just go... And... Oh, what's this? A Zatu. Well, it's a Zatu, yes, but... That's not what I was looking at. I was looking at this Pokeball. Now, I don't think I want to fuck with a Zatu yet. I, sh I sh need to stop fighting. Okay, no, I'm gonna capture this Onix. I'm gonna get the Vulpix. And I'm gonna get that Panda. I've already decided this. If Zidane is low on XP, that's fine. He'll make it back. He's Zidane. Of course he'll make it back. Okay, that didn't kill it. Okay, yeah, no. I should be able to get away with one more. But only one more. Oh, he's gonna lay the smack down on me, eh? Well, I know what to call this Onyx now. Never mind, he's dead. Man, I'm, I know I shouldn't... Okay, uh... Okay, no. I, let, let's go and bring Zidane back. Zidane. I keep calling him Zidane. Let's go bring Zidane back. The wild area is overflowing with a special sort of energy measured in watts. You can gather watts yourself from glowing Pokemon dens and glowing Pokemon in the wild. You'll also find trainers in the wild area who are willing to give you all sorts of items if you'll just give them some of your watts. Okay. But, all right. Sure. I could go get more watts. Yeah. Okay. Let's go get more watts, I guess. I can talk to these guys while I do. I can spend my watts here. A wishing piece. Oh, I see. Oh, so you can buy TRs. Wow, they re require a lot of watts, though. A heal ball. So there's HP a Pokemon caught with it and eliminates any... That seems okay, but it, it doesn't really seem like there's much point. I'd probably prefer, like, to get the stone. Hey there, trainer! You've just taken your first step into the world of camping. People call me the Camping King. Have you ever been defeated in a battle of camping? I can help you out with all your camping needs. Remember, everyone starts out as a rookie. If you've got any questions about camping, feel free to ask me. Is there anything camping related you'd like some help with? Create my curry dicks, please. First, I'll tell you about the mysterious dish called curry. Everyone in Galar has been hooked on it. So you need to mix in a berry to make the curry. Then you cover a grain called rice in it. And there you have it. It's quite literally curry with rice. But wait! There are ingredients that you can add to the dish like toppings to better suit your taste. You can make all sorts of magnificent curries while you're camping. And whenever you make a new kind of curry, it'll be automatically saved in your curry decks. So try making all matter, all manner of different curry recipes. You can make curry in this game. Interesting. Oh? Why you haven't made a single dish yet? Come back after you tried making one and show me. Okay, well, I need to make all the curry. I don't even know what my color tent is, so I'm going to just keep it like that for now, I guess. Oh, is that a skitty? Uh, I decide to quit. Oh, what is that? Oh, is that... Oh, fuck me. Yeah, hey, what is that? That's not a skitty. Oh, is that... That's a stuffle? That's yeah, one of those stuffles. Man, not interested. Okay, let's go and heal my Zidane. He's been dead for way too long. We'll go back to the wild area. We'll definitely go back to the wild area. Man, look at this place. Not bad, not bad. Is that the gym? Uh, it's kind of a neat looking gym. Man, so this is industry, huh? Here in the Gala region, I'd say it's fair to call the champion a regional hero. We're all transfixed by everything he does. The city is just massive. 
I need to keep checking my town map, otherwise I know I'll get lost. Is that a Choodle eating... A, what do they call those? A tablecloth? Yes, tablecloth. Shrinking down to fit in Pokeballs on the next thing you know, growing massive by Dynamaxing. It must be a lot of work for Pokemon. Minchi, Minchi... Is it Minchi or Mincy? This is a... That's my... Mincino? Or is it Minchino? Probably Mincino? I don't know. That one I don't know how to pronounce. Mincino slash Minchino likes things neat and tidy. It'll brush away any dust with its tail. Hey, over here. Hey, Sonia. I, I'm gonna go there. You can just chill out and wait for a little bit. Real ace of you to make it through the wild area. Seems like your trick ran your Pokemon ragged, though. You should pop into the Pokemon Center. Besides, there's something in there I bet you'll get a kick out of. If you're a real trainer and all. Night. Never mind forcing me into the Pokemon Center, then. That's fine. So what's in here? Oh, look! Oh, wait. Oh! Looks like the Rotom's free. Rotomai is free. Rotomi! I don't know. Rotomai are a kind of Rotom information service. It's a handy machine for trainers. You can even use one to customize your League card. Why don't you try playing around with your League card a bit, Frigina? Here's a sample for you. You got Leon's League card. I don't want his League card. You put the League card in your album. Show off your achievements by making a League card. You can customize your card using the card maker found at every Pokemon Center. Doing so will also update your card with all of your latest information. Well, this is making me think of Monster Hunter. And trainers all have their own league cards, and you can swap cards with other trainers that you connect with using communication features. You can view all the league cards you've collected by checking out your album, which you can find on the league card option of the X menu. Alright, cool. But Motostoke sure is big, right? Not to worry. Sonya is here to show you around a bit. Come find me after you heal up your Pokemon. The opening ceremony, huh? I get a bit worked up when I think how exciting and moving it was to actually stand on a stadium's pitch for the first time. Alright. Stadium's pitch. Ah, uh, yeah, what do you have? I should probably buy more potions. I'll probably buy some Pokeballs, too. Uh, buy six. Oh, that's basically all of my... That's basically all my Poke Dollars, though. Uh, I mean, potions have been coming in handy. No, let's see what clothes they have here first. Oh, wait, but I can sell stuff. I do have honey. I don't know if I need... Oh, I have cherries. Uh, I mean berries. I forgot about that. Wishing piece, repel. See, I don't know if I really want a, um, a repel... I mean, I guess maybe it'd be nice. I mean, it's 200. So what do you do? Do you just sell the same things? Oh, you sell different balls. Like a uh, nest ball and net ball. Water bug type. Yeah, that's the heal ball. Nah, I'm not really interested. I'm fine with just my normal Pokeballs things. Say, if you've got a Bunnelby, would you like to trade it for my Squovit? I'm not trading Pepper to you. Yeah, typically I wouldn't mind that, but I don't want to trade Pepper to you. The different shopkeepers sell different things. Who'd have thought when they look all look so similar? Yeah, it's kind of uncanny, huh? Kind of spooky. Nah. The Rotom inside Rotom are rather fond of the card maker. It's always better to weaken a Pokemon before you try and catch it. For example, you can lower its HP or use moves to put it to sleep or something. Let's heal first. Because knowing me, I might forget if I don't heal right now. Ah, thank you. Okay, let's make my card then. Um, use card maker. So let's deck my card out. 
So what kind of background do we want? That's very Scottish. Oh, man. If I use this one, then everybody will know that I too am unbeatable. Yeah, I too am unbeatable. I'm gonna keep that. Now, what's the most unbeatable effect? I mean, there's already an explosion, so let's add flames to it. I don't really want my feet covered up. There, there's nothing... There, there's nothing champion-y about having your feet covered by a frame, so... Nah. Okay, next step. Oh, I can move my thing. Okay. Um... Can I actually... Wait. Wait, back. Might change modes. Okay. So, where do I want to be standing? Okay, um... Oh, I can even rotate. I can't look backwards, though. Okay, um... Let me think here. So... Let's make myself fairly big. Um, you know, let's shrink down just a little bit. Because i got to be at least a little bit taller than Leon, I'd say. As he does his pose. Because if I want to be a true unbeatable champion, I feel like I'm going to need to be at least on his level. Although, actually, if we're doing it like that... Hmm... Yeah, I think that'll do. I think that'll do. So, expression. So. That, ah, perfect. Ah, uh, you can do like a little cheek thing. Okay. Sleepy. Dude, that's kind of spook. Mmm. That's determined. That's pissed. That's pissed with the little cheek thing. Surprised, sad, I guess kind of smirky? Hmm. Nah, this is in warning. That's about to laugh. Okay, um, let's see. What's a good facial expression for someone that wants to be an unbeatable champion? Hmm. I'm thinking that. I think that's a pretty good look for an unbeatable champion. I uh, suppose. That's why, yes. Okay, a semi-dab. Okay, that's not too bad. Not quite a dab, but close enough. Ah, yes, confidence. Nah. Okay, we we gotta go. We gotta go with this. I feel like, not. That, I feel like that's this champion, and that's. I'm about to dab on you. So, let's go ahead and throw that on. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Clear coating or matte. Ooh. Well, if it's a clear coating, then it sparkles like that, and if it's matte, it doesn't. I'll do clear coding. Nah, print it. Print my card. Alright, perfect. So I have my card now. Excellent. Uh, can't go wrong. Okay, I guess let's explore a bit of Motostoke. I mean, she'll probably take me around, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. Here, take me around the city. I won't go around myself. I won't go around myself yet. I feel like I need to really adjust my seating here soon. Getting a little uncomfy. So, brilliant young trainer who's braved the wild area. Do you remember what your goal in Motostoke is? Uh, now I'm here for the gym challenge. Yep, the gym challenge opening ceremony. How am I going right now? Is that a Pokemon playing, like, three-card Monty with a guy? He's getting scammed. By the way, the ceremony tomorrow is being held at the Motostoke Stadium, okay? That big thing. Alright. Use that lift over there to get to the stadium, okay? 
Right? Can do. Well, la okay, you didn't really take me anywhere. Well, laters, I'm going to swing by the shop, so I'm here. But don't forget to register at the stadium, okay? Night, catch you later, Sonia. True, true. It's wonderful that there's space for Stinny to relax and enjoy itself. In fact, I'm tempted to join it and quench my thirst, too. Oh, that's kind of cute, actually. Having little fountains for the different Pokemon sizes. That's kind of adorable. I never get tired of watching those giant steam-powered gears turning. I'm sure you'll be here watching those forever. I got a nugget. Now I can sell that, I think. A nugget of the purest gold that gives off a lustrous gleam and direct light. It can be sold at a high price at shops. Okay. Motostoke is something else. What other city has a left to take you between the upper and lower districts? How can I not go there yet? I don't know why that would turn me away, but okay. How are you? That meal was a delight. Oh, look at a mailbox. It's a mailbox that Pokemon collect letters from. Same thing down here. Not graffiti! How dare you, kids. Leon throws his Pokeballs with so much energy. Now if the Pokemon inside get dizzy. You gotta throw Pokeballs. Throw them over and over to get your pitching technique sorted. Yeah, I never really thought about that, I guess. About, like, the technique of throwing a Pokeball. There probably would be some kind of technique to it. I love flower Pokemon. I always bring flowers home on special days or even normal days. My Pokemon loves the scent of flowers so much. Does that get your Pokemon? We use the Pokemon move growth to raise our flowers so they get rather large. Alright. I just don't want to miss anybody. I seem like no one there to get my hair cut. You can really tell a person's character by going shopping with them. My husband... Well, he doesn't think too much about what he buys. There's something satisfying about actually being able to hold the products when you shop. Then again, buying things online and having Pokemon deliver them to you has its own charm. Speed is important. It lets you attack first. Thank you very much, random dude. Okay, let's see if I can get my hair cut. Let's see what hairstyles we can get. Welcome. Lovely to see you. What would you like to do today? Ooh, that's a lot of money. Oh, shit. I need to... Add, oh, wow. I actually had to pay it. And, right? Out of pocket? What if I get nothing changed? Okay, well, I guess... Let's just have a look and see. Now, this is very, um... What's that one character from Kaon? Megumi, I think? Uh, I'm not really interested, though. Oh, I can change the color. I kind of like what I have, to be honest. It's neat that you can have uh, these kind of color changes, though. That's pretty cool. I don't really consider this makeup, though. Okay, what was my dark brown, right? Yeah. Cat eye extensions. Ah, oh, I see. Okay, um, hmm. Hmm. Eh, yeah, we'll go natural. I'm gonna look so boring and plain. Ultramarine. Multicolor swirl. Oh my god. Uh, you know, I don't know. On one hand, maybe, but on the other hand, that's kind of terrifying. It'd be cool if you can get those in real life. Ah, uh, now she's dead inside. I don't think I want her to be dead inside. I don't really want her to have fire in her eyes either, though. Um, ah, this must be what everyone has when they look at Leon. He's never been defeated, you know. He's kind of the champion. Um, 
I think I'll just stick with Brown. I kind of like her default look, if I'm being honest. I mean, that's exactly what I had already. So I paid a thousand dollars to change nothing, basically. You look fresher than a mint. Nah, I'm pretty good. Well now, oh look, it's a uh, fox on. Did fox off? If you want to change the world, you've got to start with yourself. And why not start changing yourself by changing your look with a new hairstyle? I want to. I mean, I want to have a look at them at least. I didn't really want to pay. It looks as though you're shy on cash. Okay, well, that's a lot of money to change my hair. But I want to see what they look like. Okay, I'm going to go and maybe sell some more things. Yeah, I'm going to sell some more things. Because I, I want money now to be able to look fashionable and look cool. I have a fishing rod? Wait, when did I get this? When did I get a fishing rod? Well, shit, I should have been fishing, like, a long time ago. Because I remember there was that spot by uh, the uh, Magnolia's house. Where I, it looked like you can fish, and I was like, oh. Yeah, I thought to myself, oh, I kind of want to fish there. But I didn't know I had a fishing rod. Okay, I don't know when I picked that up. Um... Excuse me. Yeah, I don't really need your pills yet. Ah, well... Uh, I need to see what hairstyles they have. I need to know. If I don't know, it's gonna drive me crazy. Okay. Okay, wait. I'll go in there soon. Let's just see what else we have here that I can possibly buy. Like, this looks like a food shop. Ah, oh, Hoot Hoot. Oh yeah, that's what I said, Hoot Hoot. Where are you, dapper man? Hoot Hoot enjoys bitter flavors just fine. But I've got more of a sweet tooth myself. If you manage to really shine during the gym challenge, you'll become a star of the Galar region. Okay, I don't really want to talk to you anymore. I want to talk to your friend. You've seen Leon's cape, right? All those sponsor logos are pretty impressive. But couldn't they come up with a better design? Possibly. What are you? Reem Reem! Chee 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 and Grrrr. My friend! He's just obsessed with Mis Mr. Kabu. He even collects Mr. Kabu's league cards. Gym leader Kabu is amazing. He's older than my dad, but he's still nowhere near retiring. Now I'll be still a gym leader when it's my turn to do the gym challenge. Today's coffee is something special. The Pokemon helping out did a good job. Okay, and, uh, what... Welcome to the Battle Cafe. Oh, okay. Oh, you can battle here once a day. If you win, I'll give you a treat on the house. Sure, why not? Okie dokie, let's have a break. Alright, let's see if I can beat Miss Master Dwight. Cafe Master Dwight. A combi. Oh. Watch, level 50 Pokemon. I'm willing to bet. No, level 10. Okay, that's doable. Okay, so Combi looks like a bug, I'm gonna assume. So Ember should be good. Yeah, perfect. It's super effective. Oh, well, that was, that was it. Okay, that was easy. <laughs> I hope that battle was a... Delicate, sweet taste for you. 800 Poke Dollars. Yes. I'm okay with that. So once a day, is that real time? That was a battle as exciting as a glass of pinap juice. Here's the treat I promised. What do I get? I got a dollop of whipped cream. You put a dollop of whipped cream in your bag's other items pocket. 
Okay, well, that's very nice, but it'd be nice to have something with the whipped cream, you know? Not just whipped cream itself. A soft and sweet treat made of fluffy, puffy, whipped, and whirled cream. It's loved by a certain Pokemon. Look forward to your next visit. A certain Pokemon, you say? Well, I don't know... Well, I don't know much about that yet, so I'm gonna leave it for now. And no doubt come back to it later. Oh, you're a Pokemon trainer. Here, let me give you something nice. Try using it on your Pokemon. Focus energy. That might not be too bad on someone. User takes a deep breath, deep breath and focuses on that critical hits. Oh, and focuses so that critical hits land more easily. Okay. TRs are vintage. You can use them to have your Pokemon learn rare moves. They break after one use, too, which is also extra old school. That is true. Uh, I do remember TMs used to break. Which is why I never used them. Because I was like, oh, what if I want one for later? I never did, but I always wanted the option. I say, there's no such thing as youth fashion or old people's fashion. Only good fashion. Too true, old man. I'm looking for something that'll make me stand out even in a vast wild area. The clothes I like the best aren't necessarily the most flattering. It's a real struggle. My grand told me I needed to go on a journey, but a girl a bit. But a girl needs a bit of joy in her life too. Are you here to do some shopping as well? Don't forget to register at the stadium. Alright. Uh yeah, let me find something cool. Iconic style. I kinda wanna see what that looks like underneath, so take off. Uh, Mmm, yeah, it's probably okay. A polywag, nice. Polywag pop! It's kind of nice. I like that. You know, I kind of like that. I could maybe trade out my hoodie. Oh, uh, it's the champ! Oh, that's me right there. Varsity jacket, eh. Not really feeling varsity jackets or parkas. Maybe a hoodie, though. A hoodie might be nice. Ah, oh, denim. You know, ripped denim might be kind of nice, too, actually. So, I mean, look at that. It's pre-ripped. Pre Although, a skirt would also be pretty okay. No dresses. Okay, I can't really look at the socks. Although, I'm sure plaid socks would be nice. Ankle boots. Eh. Um, you know, I don't know. Uh, I don't. I don't really dig that hat. Not. Oh, look at that though. Oh, dude, I'm looking cool as fuck. But the thing is, do I really want glasses to hide my eyes? I don't know. I spent good money on having brown eyes. I don't know if I really want to hide them, even though they're already the eyes I had. Hmm. I'll think about it. These might be okay. I mean, I look cool as fuck, right? Do I want that, though? Hmm. Gloves. Hmm. Yeah, let's stop shopping for the moment. Let's go see what kind of hairstyles I can get. So, spending 3000 basically. And then maybe I'll get some new clothes. I, You know, I don't know why it takes your money just right away. Because the thing is, what if I change nothing, right? If I change nothing, then that's wasted money. I'll take your bag and things too. Now then, what kind of look do you want today? I See, I like the short bob, so I don't really mind keeping it. Because it's a nice hairstyle. But I'm, I'm just really curious to see what else they have. Hmm. I mean, pixie cuts are cute. See, I actually do think pixie cuts are pretty cute. Hmm. 
Not really feeling most of these, though. I don't think of... See, I, see, I kind of want to stick with the short bob. Like, a pixie cut's okay. Not really digging any of these other ones. But I do kind of like the classic short bob look. And that's maybe just because that's how I've seen the character. So it just seems more natural to have a short bob to me. But, like, none of these really stick out to me as something I want her to wear, I guess. No thanks. I kind of also like Sideswept. Like, really, the default... Default is what I like, funnily enough. It just looks the best to me, personally. Um, I'm not... I don't really think I need to change the hair color, though. So, look at that. Once again, I didn't even do anything. 3,000 Poké Dollars. And I didn't even change a single thing. I look exactly the same. Yeah, no, I want my hat back, please. I was like, oh yeah, I'm sure it'll look good with your hat on as well. Okay, let's go buy some new duds. I I'm feeling... Oh, but wait, is there more up here for me to spend on? How's it? I came all the way from Alola to watch the gym challenge in person. All the way from Alola, huh? Onyx is big, but it can get even bigger by Dynamaxing. Oh, what's this? Got a shiny. Found a super potion. Perfect. A spirit type medicine for treating wounds. It can be used to restore 60 HP to a single Pokemon. Alright, nice. If I could choose my own uniform number, which one should I pick? I can't make up my mind. I can't wear the same uniform as my favorite gym leader. I'd get way too nervous. Here, let me give you these high-tech earbuds. Oh, no need to thank me. It's just a whim. I obtained a set of high-tech earbuds. Are these AirPods? Put a set of high-tech earbuds in your... Okay, wait. Strange earbuds that allow you to freely control the volume of various sounds. That's kind of nice. I don't know why they can just put that in the menu, but I mean, that's nice, I guess. Do you know what's so high-tech about the high-tech earbuds? When you put them in your ears, they actually let you control the sound of your surroundings. You know, that would be pretty cool, actually, in real life. That'd be neat. I'd like that. Well, see, I wouldn't really need to use it, but I know a lot of people that would. Um, you can even make them stop specific sounds, like Pokemon cries. Oh, okay. Nothing else to say. No, okay. Just the same. There are many books. The ad says the magazine with a special feature on all the gym leaders is the most popular. I'd read it. That sounds cool. Grrr. No, it's, oh, it's Charizard. And the champion who's never been defeated before, Leon. I'd surely never make it to the stadium without you to show me the way, partner. Even with a huge old thing like this bang in the middle of the city, I still get lost. Trigina. All right. Yeah, I'm fine. I spent like 4,000 Poké Dollars today on nothing, but you know. One look tells me you've become a trainer worthy of that endorsement I gave you. And yes, I reckon you might even be ready to use this. Here, try this to your partner to... Wait, yeah, try giving this to your partner to hold. A piece of charcoal. You put the piece of charcoal in your bag's other item's pocket. An item... To be held by a Pokemon. It's a combustible fuel that boosts the power of fuel a fuel type moves, a fire type moves. You can take that lift up to the city's upper level if you're headed for the stadium next. Now nah, I'm gonna go and spend money on clothes. Because of course I am. Steam power is amazing! It can even move that giant lift. Can indeed. I'm always frightened by airplanes and whatnot. How those giant chunks of metal move so fast. Pokemon don't bother me though. Mr. Rose has a real love for the Galar region. It's not enough to help keep us all supplied with energy. He even supports the gym challenge. There's more books. I don't know why they have, like, two bookstores on the same road that sell the same things. I guess it's not too far off from real life, though. Uh... 
Um, okay, let's buy something cool. So, I think my shirt's fine. I kind of want a new hoodie, though. I think I'll grab a hoodie. That has an Umbreon on the back, too. That's pretty nice. Yeah, so I'll spend that on a hoodie. See, now I'm debating, though. Like, skirt? Or jeans? Skirt or jeans? I don't have the money for them either way, actually. So, you know what? Never mind. The hoodie is all I need. And the hoodie is what I will take. Alright. Yeah, it's fine. A new hoodie. Right? Um. <clears throat> okay, well, I guess that's... I guess that's it for now. Okay, well, let's go up. Let's talk to Leon. Let's go up and have a look at the stadium. I guess you might want to have a look around the city first. Only don't get lost like I do. When you're ready to visit the stadium, take the lift to get up there. That can do. Oh my god. What? What are you? The stadium is so huge! I wonder how many houses would fit inside. Ah, oh, that's the kid talking, not, not the Pokeball guy. Ta-da! You took the time to talk to a Pokeball, so you deserve a little reward. Thank you, Pokeball guy. In case you're wondering, I'm not just any old Pokeball. But then who am I, you ask? Well, the answer is simple. They call me the Ball Guy. Okay, sure. He, you know who he kind of reminds me of, actually? He kind of reminds me of Pepsi Man. A little bit. Just a little bit of Pepsi Man. You made it, too? Motostoke Stadium. This is where the opening ceremony will be held. Everyone will be watching the opening ceremony for the gym challenge. My mom, your mom, the whole world. It's getting me a bit nervous, really. Nah, this isn't nerves. I'm only trembling because I'm so excited. Come on, Fergina. It's time the world learned our names. Alright, I'll go in there in a moment. Um, so I spoke to the Pokeball man. Or Ball Guy, excuse me. At last, the gym challenge is opening ceremony. My heart is pounding with all the excitement. And that forces me back here, alright. The gym leaders will show up for the gym challenge opening ceremony. Ah, Motostoke Stadium. This is where the opening ceremony is held. Ex uh, excuse me. Exhibition matches are super exciting, too. Okay, I do not... I talked to you already, kid. The stadium can even handle Dynamax Pokemon battling inside. It is said that long, long ago, there was a giant stadium made entirely out of stone. That's impressive. I, well, I guess not really. What? Oh, dude. Core. Okay, that's a cool-looking Pokemon. Kinda want. Corviknight is a Pokemon that flies all about, carrying people where they want to go. But even they get tuckered out. So I assume that's a fast travel thing for later. If I had to take a guess. We League staff are here to provide support for the various matches that occur throughout the Gym Challenge. Everyone participating in the Gym Challenge is welcome to stay at the Badoo Drop Inn. Oh, there's stuff over here. A fountain. Nice. You found three burn heels. Okay, I wonder... I wonder if that's a sign. A spray-type medicine for treating burns. It can be used to heal a single Pokemon suffering from a burn. Speaking of which, actually, let's give uh, Zidane here that charcoal. I wonder if that changes depending on what Pokemon you start with. I bet you it does. He probably gives you a charcoal for, um... Yeah, score bunny and something watery for Sobble and Grassy for Grookey, you know. 
Found a repel. We can sell one of those later. We can sell that later. Okay, we tell you what, let's, um, if, if, oops, if I remember how to open it. I guess let's drop a save, because we've been going for, like, well, on the recording, it's been about four hours, so I think, I, I don't know if in-game time is just slow, or whatever, but we've been going for about four hours now, so I guess it's probably time I call it there. So, hopefully this was good, hopefully this is a kind of a good start. Um... Hopefully this was a good first session. Next time we'll hop straight into the gym. And yeah, for now, I guess that's it for... See, normally by this point I'd say, oh, I guess that's it for the stream, but this isn't a stream. See, I need to get I need to get that through my head that this isn't a stream. Um, so I can't go using stream words. And I can't go checking that all the time for chat because there isn't none. Um, but yeah, thank you everybody for watching the stream. I did it right then. Fuck. Okay, never mind. Okay, anyway. Thank you, everybody, for watching. And uh, hopefully you enjoyed the session. And for now, well, I guess that's it. So I will catch you guys on well, the next session of Pokemon. All right. Here I go.